got it, I got it, I got it. Hey, hey, hey. Yeah, hey, hey. Whoa, this is a really feisty little. Right, it's snake. They, they strike back really quickly on, the, on themselves. This is a really little one as well. Difficult to manipulate. Okay. This is the adder and Britain's only venomous snake. I reckon this one's a sub-adult female because of her lovely golden colour. Juveniles are also brownie, but a lot smaller. Other species of this genus include the puff adder in Africa, responsible for a heck of a lot of bites, really serious, life-threatening bites, or the Russell's viper in India, that venom would start breaking down the capillary and arterial walls. You start coughing, <coughs> cough up your own blood, and die. But this guy is a low venom yield, and therefore, even an adult would struggle to kill a human here in the UK. That said, these snakes have killed at least a dozen people here in Britain during the last century, and so I've got to be a little careful. As I explained earlier, they feed off small rodents and amphibians, and they're an incredibly wide-ranging species, living as far north as the Arctic Circle in Russia. And part of the reason they're able to do this is because of that venom. The snake will bite its prey, release, and then let it run off. An hour or so later, when the animal has died, the adult will use its superb sense of smell to locate its victim, by which time that venom has started internally digesting the tissues and organs, and the snake can swallow it down without relying on its cold environment to give it the energy needed to fully digest its meal. Now, although a young fox or badger may try and have a go at one of these snakes, they'll soon learn it's not worth the trouble of getting envenomated and will not be making the same mistake again. Therefore, the British adder has no natural enemies and the main reason this species is pretty much restricted to national parks and is in decline is because of human encroachment into its habitat. So I'm just going to let this one go on her way.